Hey, what's up you guys? Steve with Fly Fly Drones here. Been away for a while, doing some other things, starting a restaurant. A uh, new version of the Dumbledore 3.10 tool dropped. I want to do a quick video. Uh, that's what it supports. Go ahead and read the documentation. These are the release notes that Jazab uh, put together. New anti-rollback function. Uh, it's got a cool new ADB enable where you can root until reboot, PVV ver2, uh, link to dig downloader. This is a really good release, you guys. Um, you can get it from github.com slash jazab Dumbledore releases. There'll be a link in the, the notes as well. So go ahead and uh, open up a web browser, go to that URL. Uh, you'll see the 3.10 release here. This has all the details on the release notes. I uh, click the zip file, whatever you want there. Download it, extract it, and then double click the exe. Once you open that, you'll see the, the main part of the, uh, the tool here. As regular, you can load firmware. Uh, you can pick any firmware you want, and then you can flash it. We'll come to that at the end. Uh, you'll see here then we got a couple new functions, or other not new, but different functions. Uh, we can unlock. Uh, if you get your drone locked, you can lock it. You can activate it. Uh, if you've got a Mavic, it's brand new. You can activate it offline so it doesn't send anything to the DJI servers. Click that button. Wait a minute. It'll do what it needs to. Uh, you see a couple other things here. We've got Dink Downloader. Um, we've got we can pull the uh, the install log files. Uh, this is probably the the coolest thing I like is it's got a button and a link to the Dink Downloader tool. Uh, this is a really cool tool that was put together that basically allows you to download any firmware the DJI has come out with. Uh, communities work really hard to get everything in here that they can or as much as possible. It's got the new stuff, the Mavic, the Phantom, Inspire, it's got the old stuff, uh, the P3, all the P3 stuffs in here, the Inspire 1 firmware, it's got remote control firmware, uh, A3, N3 chips, it's got custom rolled firmware. Uh, if you guys haven't checked out the Dank Downloader tool, that thing is the bomb, so check that out. Um, it takes a little bit sometimes, my laptop's a little slow there to, to come up, but you can see here, got tons of stuff you hit that drop down you can pick whatever you want i can pick custom rolled firmware uh, for the guys that are interested in the mix and match this has everything just ready to go so yeah this is a really good addition uh kudos and a you know applause to just have for including that in this uh definitely a, a good one to have in there so use this to download your firmware um it's really easy just find the one that you want hit the download button a couple minutes later it'll be finished so yeah it's really not too bad so check that out um but overall this tool is really solid you guys um i've done it on my remote control i've done it on my mavic um, i've had no problems really good really stable release this is by far the best tool that's out there to flash your uh, your aircraft. So, you know, check it out. Um, just wanted to do a quick video to kind of share this and share with some of the details in there. Um, do the flashing, the update, the modding procedure as you always have done in the past. You can just use this tool to, uh, to get where you need to. So that's all. Uh, check out our Facebook group, the DJ Modding Lounge, and also say hi to the OGs in Slack. All right, guys. Take care.